Welcome back for another album collection video here. This is where we're going to take a look at my Bill Evans Trio, Live at the Sunday Village Vanguard, featuring Scott LaFair. I believe that was his bassist, if I'm not mistaken. Yes. And he died shortly after this uh, recording. Uh, he was in a car accident. Um, great bassist. You can really hear him. Uh, his talent in the solo his solo in this, uh, throughout this live performance. So what we have here is two OJCs. Original OJC on CD. CD. It's kind of a tongue twister. I believe this is an 80s copy, maybe early 90s. I believe I have it in it, yes. Sounds great. And I wanted this before I got this because I heard it was coming out and there's other editions of it out there um and yeah the CD sounds great um but uh it came to me already opened from a online retailer I'm not gonna name who it is and I was very surprised they let this happen would not expect that from them because they have a very good track record um so was not too happy about that. Prepare for the next video right quick. Um, and, um, uh, but after, you know, inspecting the record, I have determined there's no damage. But if there is, when I go to play it, which I haven't had time to do lately, I've been so busy with work, um, so, yeah, um, but this is all analog mastering. From the original tapes by Kevin Gray at Coherent Audio, pressed on 180 gram vinyl at RTI. There's a picture of the band there, and there's other, uh, I believe there's other pictures from this photo shoot or, or another one um, with the band, uh, with them smoking, sitting at a table just chilling, talking. Um, so yeah, this came out in 2002, and the reason I didn't get, didn't get it sooner is because it went out of stock at, uh, pretty much every online retailer, uh, probably even local record shops, but I really don't go to those very often anymore, <clears throat> so once in a blue moon type thing, used to go a lot, but with the advent of online shopping, that changed for me. Anyways, um... Let's see if these photos are inside this edition. I don't think they are. Nope. Just a Fantasy Records uh, mailing catalog. Uh, mailer. It would be interesting to do that. You can tell this paper has kind of yellowed over the years. But still a very good release. Um... No, no photo. Um, back to this. I'm sure that this will sound just fine. It does have a textured cover. I can kind of see and feel that here. I'm not going to take the shrink off. I'm going to leave these, the shrink on all the OJCs that I possibly can. So hopefully none can damage to where the shrink is coming off or anything like that. Which would force me to take the shrink off. And no, I'm not a stickler for that kind of thing. Just certain records I'll do that with. Because I want to preserve the cover. So all these come in their own craft labeled rice paper sleeves. There's the Riverside label. Very cool. the texture on the back too no the texture is only on the front but this yeah good heavyweight vinyl no defects upon inspection and I'm thinking someone sent this back they ordered it and maybe it just wasn't something they liked um, yeah that was disappointing made me angry and I wanted to return it but I'm gonna try it out I have a little while until I have to you know can uh, I have a Return window is still open. Um, yeah, the clarity of this image is much better than this OJC. 
CD. But I understand, you know, they did the best they could. Probably back when they printed this. Versus, you know, over a little over 30 years later. Um, but yeah, this performance was done in 1961. Uh, but yeah, this is stereo. It's also a mono available, like in original form, anyways. This has not been reissued in mono uh, recently that I know of. But yeah, um, picked this album up. This is a companion to Waltz for Debbie, and I own that as well on OJ CD and the OJ CD release from this series. Um, uh, I'll talk about some of the standout tracks. I think they're, yeah, they're here on the back. So you have, oh, this has bonus tracks on it. Has three bonus, five, four bonus tracks on here. Hmm. Um, Glory's Step is Great, My Mind is Gone Now, Solar, Alice in Wonderland, All of You, Jade Visions. Uh, every song on here is great, I, I think. Uh, <clears throat> Uh, the only LP I don't have is Everybody Digs Bill Evans, and that is getting a Record Store Day release in mono, reissue in mono, <clears throat> on vinyl, this year, for Record Store Day, the upcoming Record Store Day. Um, I'm not going to get that, I'm going to hold off and see about getting probably a CD copy first, and just listen to that and see if I really really like it that's what I've been doing lately I'll buy the CD copy first and kind of splurge for the LP copy but that's just my guess they'll probably release that in stereo later on everybody digs Bill Evans uh, in this series maybe <clears throat> um, so yeah uh, that's really all I have to say about this fantastic excuse me fantastic album pick it up in any format that you possibly can and that's the video. Thank you for watching, commenting, and subscribing.